As we continue to move through these high frequency energy waves that are coming, we're going to start to notice something that's a little bit strange. Now, a lot of you probably have already started to feel this. I'd love to hear from you. So leave a comment or a thumbs up if you have. We're moving into an energy that is, you can look at it from a timeline perspective as very ancient. It's us. It's who we truly are. It's the real us. Now, when we move up into these frequency bands, we start to detach from the timeline. Our mind doesn't know what to make of this energy. It's very nebulous feeling. So when we try to assign some sort of meaning to it or programming to it, it doesn't feel good. It feels very uncomfortable. That is us remembering who we really are. Remember, we're energetic beings, multidimensional beings that reside in all dimensions, including those outside of the time-space reality. And that's what we're starting to feel. We're starting to get back into that energy, taking a step into it. And of course, when the mind perceives that, it freaks out, doesn't like it. It can't label it, doesn't know what to do with it. So it throws up these thoughts of, hey, this isn't good. This is uncomfortable, right? So think about that when you get into these spaces of not feeling comfortable um, or not knowing where you're headed, not knowing where your life is headed, the first step in figuring all that out is to get anchored and grounded in the body. That gets your energy flowing. That expands your consciousness. That creates space. With that space will come guidance, will come intuition that will rise up. Okay. So we don't want to shut the gate just as we're about to step through it. We want to step through it and embrace that feeling of uncomfortableness, that feeling of not knowing, because we're in a space right now where trust is very, very important. We're detaching from the old world, from the old ways of living, from the old ways of doing things. And we're embracing or we're being given an opportunity to embrace the not knowing. Okay. And the not knowing is from the perspective of the mind, because again, it doesn't know what to make of this awesome, amazing high frequency energy that is starting to move through us. So if we can embrace that process, we could step away from resistance, create more space within our body, right? And allow that energy to flow and that intuition and that guidance will start to make it up here and ideas will come, energy will flow, motivation will come. So we have a habit of clamping that off. We want to run fight or flight when there's something that we're feeling that is um, labeled as bad or unfamiliar, right? That gets us out of our comfort zone. We don't like that. We like to be comfortable and that limits us. The limitations are falling away. So we embrace, embrace this feeling of not knowing, embrace this feeling of trusting, embrace the feeling of uncomfortableness and sit and be present with it and breathe with it. It's coming us to be, it's coming up to be felt. So we want to fully feel it. And as we do that and we start to breathe with it, we're going to create more space and more of that's going to land. And what comes along with that? Our multidimensional aspects, our higher self, our soul literally steps down and drops in, drop in soul, right? We've heard that term. And we start to embody that. And with that comes all the knowing, the memories, the instructions, all of it to create the life that you want to create right here on earth as we move into um, from the old earth into the new earth. So if this video resonated, give it a thumbs up, leave a comment below. Again, if you know what I'm talking about, if you could feel that, um, I'd love to hear from you. Share this with anyone that you think might need it. I would greatly appreciate it. Till next time, guys. Thank you.